Hello, Taskmaster. What do you got for me? No new bounty hunts. What about errands? We do have a couple new errands. Uh, and one of them I already knew was coming, because the Ding Dong Dell Gatekeeper, I noticed that happening on the map. I should have talked to him then and there, but whatever. Uh, Mumuni Artist. The Raj Mahal Curry Stall is doing, is still, is doing great business. And then Hamlin. So, one in each of the four major cities, then. Alright, well, let's go and take care of those, then. So, first, the Ding Dong Dell Gatesman, Gatekeeper. What is what does he have to say? Hello, sir. What have you been careless about? Your beloved cat's whiskers have been stolen. I see. Well, I think those footprints point to a likely culprit. How did you get- how did a monster steal from you, though? Also, eight stamps? You bet I'll recover your cat's whiskers! Just follow the footprints. They lead out of town, yes, I can see that, but where do- where do I go once out of town? I don't seem to- oh! Here are more footprints. They lead off to the west. Alright, so let's just follow- yep, there are more footprints there, so I guess we're just gonna follow the path. And the footprints lead to the northwest, yes. I see the next set of footprints. We are drawing ever closer to the culprit. That monster ran away from us into our direction. To the north? Okay. Yep, I see our, our next set of footprints. Hey, guys. Don't worry about me. I'm too strong for you. Off to the north. They seem relatively fresh. So, our monster... Our monster is near. Is it that thing right there, just standing still jumping? It must be. Hello, sir! Let's fight the Whisker Thief! For justice! Gob Forsaken. Stay calm now. What a name. Uh, let's, let's open with, with Luigi to let out a war cry. And now that our attack is up, it's time to switch to Puss in Boots to just let this gob forsaken monster have it. What a name. Cause it's a goblin and it's god forsaken. It's funny. Funny names. It's also god forsaken because I'm kicking its ass. And there we go. All right, sir. Give us those cat whiskers back. There is no sign of the cat's whiskers. It seems that the creature was innocent. Drippy. These are different footprints. I can't believe we've been following the wrong trail. So I guess it's time to double back to Ding Dong Dell and try and find the correct trail. Alright, let's start us again. These ones lead off to the west. Hmm. These still look like the same tracks. Let's examine them again just to be sure. Okay. Northwest still. Let's keep our eyes out for more tracks. 
I think these these are the different tracks right here. Which means that these are the correct tracks. Which now lead off to the northwest. Okay, we're on the correct trail again. I wonder if these tracks only appear after you, you defeat the Gob Forsaken, or if this... Or if, if you were perceptive enough, if you could have noticed and gone after the correct tracks right from the get-go. Footprints lead off to the west, over the broken bridge? Okay. Oh, and there's the next set of tracks. These ones look like they head off to the... No, I think these are a different set of tracks. I'm pretty sure these are a different set of tracks. These look like puppy dog tracks rather than like... Yep. Yeah. Okay, we I found the next set of tracks. Yeah, because these ones are, like, duck tracks. And they seem relatively fresh. Does that mean that this big guy is our culprit? Looks like it. Hey, buddy. Alright, let's fight the, the real Whisker Thief this time. Igneous Supremus. Uh, igneous means fire, I believe. So, let's huck a frostbite at it and see what it does. Alright, looks like it is indeed weak to water attacks. So let's just keep lighting it up with... You know what, Let, let's throw Puss in Boots in there and see what his damage output. I think Puss in Boots' damage output is better, so let's just keep... Attacking with Puss in Boots, as usual. <laughs> a monster weak to water was using Bubble Bath, which I would assume is a water move. That's kind of funny. But alright, Igneous Supremus. You think you're smart. You think you're clever. You ain't. What you are is about to be dead. Come on, I will switch it out at the last second. Alright, Luigi, your turn. I don't think your damage output is quite as good, but it's still fine. So just get in there, Luigi. Get in there and take over until Puss in Boots can, can finish the fight. Alright, Puss in Boots can now finish the fight. So get in there! And... Good night, Igneous Supremus. We did it. And we got the cat's whiskers. So it's time to bring them back to our guardsmen at Ding Dong Dell, and then head to the next region. <laughs> hey buddy, I got, I got your cat's whiskers back. <sighs> Radiant Blade, huh? I like how that looks. Let, let's equip that on someone immediately. Oh, is Radiant Blade? Yes, so now now Luigi heals when attacking. Very nice. Alright, so next up is Al Mamoon. Hello, Mr. Painter, sir. Con the artist. What is wrong? The picture I'm currently painting, I cannot seem to get it right. It is a study of the fierce and noble beauty of a girl child, wild as the hills of... What? Is 
Is he asking me... See, a girl wild as the hills, a forest dweller. Okay, so either he wants me to get a very specific familiar, or he wants me to talk to one of the people in, like, the forest village near Ding Dong Dell. Uh, I'm going to hope it's that, because he said forest dweller, that makes sense to me. Uh, but at first I did notice that there was something else here in Al Moon to grab. Which is probably the other side quest, which I just assumed would have been in Tahiti. But I guess I was incorrect. Yep, there it is. Hey buddy, what's up? What do you need? More orders than you can meet. You began offering a delivery service. You want us to deliver your curries. Curry in a hurry, huh? Okay. First delivery is to the Sheik of Spice here in Almamu. So am I actually timed on this? Maybe not. Um Okay. So this is this is an interesting side quest. The savior of this world is now an errand boy for for a curry stand. <laughs> what an interesting fate. Love how NPCs always love to use these, like, destined heroes just for their menial tasks. There you go. Here is your curry. Time to go back and get the next order. I wonder how many orders we have. Sir, we are here to pick up the the next orders. It is the most illustrious personage in all of Castaway Cove. Okay, well, I'll do that in a moment. First, I want to go check up on the forest dwellers in Ding Dong Dell to see if any of them are willing to model for Khan the Artist. Okay, I cheated a little and looked up this errand because... Uh, I couldn't find it in any of the forests I knew about. Um, and it turns out that the person we are looking for is in a forest I did not know existed. Uh, down here on the, the Turtle Crag, or whatever it's called, there's a forest here that has the model for Mr. Khan the Artist. Hello, hello, everybody. Uh, first things first. This chest is mine. A suit of Enigma armor. And then, hello. A girl child, wild as the hills in the forest. Give her the tea, man. Okay, well, is this going to just bring me back automatically? Alright, uh, I was just going to swing by after delivering the cutty in uh, Castaway Cove, but I guess we're doing this now. Alright, there we go. Now this errand is done and we get another, like, eight stamps, six stamps. That's still a lot, though. Um, alright, well, now to Castaway Cove to deliver the curry there, and then I wonder who he has for us next. It's probably going to be three deliveries to make. It's usually the rule of three in video games, but could be more, could be seven. It's always three or seven for some reason. Good numbers, I guess. Oh, 
Hello, sir. I have the curry for you. Alright. Well, now that that's done, back to the stand to see what our next delivery will be. Sir, I have made your delivery. And then the next someone... And next is for someone in the Empire of Hamlin. That prides itself on selling every item under the sun. I'm thinking the black market. <laughs> but this is also fine because we were planning to go to Hamlin anyway to pick up a side quest. So it all works out, I think. Hopefully this is the last delivery we have to make, though. Yeah, it does indeed look like the black market is where we have to go. And I'm going to pick up our new side quest first, just to see what it is. Maybe it's something we can get out of the way quickly. Hello, sir. What seems to be the issue? You, you've you slept in 456 days in a row. An alarm clock that you asleep be gone. I believe I have asleep be gone, so do not worry, sir. Here you are. Sleep be gone. What is the next favor? I do think I actually have a cappuccino, so that's fine. I swear, if you have one more fa favor. If a familiar that knew the trick, rise and shine. How lucky, because I believe... Uh, well, first, I'm gonna look and see if I have familiars that have any empty slots. Looks like I do. But yes, how, how, how convenient, because I have... Um, uh, let's use it on Poe. Because I believe I have a gem that teaches Arise and Shine. I have so many gems that I haven't used. Yep, there it is. Oh, it wasn't that it has free, free moves, it's just that I haven't fully equipped it with moves. Whatever, doesn't matter. Let's get rid of... Um, let's get rid of Fling Flame because it has Firewall. There we go. Are you done now? Are you good? Okay, we're good. Good lord, man. Seven merit stamps, though. That's a, a good amount of merit stamps, so I believe we only have the the one side quest left, yes? And if I'm lucky, all we have left to do with it is to deliver this last curry and then be, be done with. Sir, I believe I have an order for you. All right. Oh, by the w how he worded that, it, we definitely have more orders to deliver. Fantastic. But this one's out of the way, so let's head back to Alba Moon and see what our next job is. Sir, the order is finished. What is next? It was for one who is all bones. So we're going to the casino, then. Alright. To Skull Mountain? No, not Skull Mountain. Um... The Tombstone Trial we go, I suppose. Alright, which one of you fools ordered some curry? 
It was you! Here you are, sir. You can't just ask things like that, Trippy. Well, we've delivered the Gurry to the Skelemans, so time to head back and hope that is the last order? I have my doubts. Sir, the delivery has been made. The customer is one who dwells in a lost village hidden deep in a forest to the west of Ding Dong Dell. You okay over there, Drippy? Drippy, you... Okay. Okay, so this will be the last order. And a forest to the west of Ding Dong Dell, you say. I know of one to the east. I guess it's just a matter of, like, looking around for places that would be... That would house hidden forests, huh? Uh, over here seems like a, a candidate. I think actually, I may have been to a, a forest. Yeah, I think I've actually been here before, but nope, I absolutely have not because I would have, I would have looted these chests immediately, but this seems to be our guy. Alright, well, time to head back to Animal Moon and finally turn this quest in, and then we will definitely have enough to get some mer one of two different merit stamp rewards. So, let's see which one we want to grab. Alternatively, I could save up for Giant Killer Jack just to see what the hell that does. But, I think I'll just pick one of the two. Sir, we have made our delivery. Twenty bowls of Tiki Mahala. Thank you very much, my guy. Alright, and that finishes our side quests for now. I'm glad that there were there were only four, but they were a long four. But I'm glad that it was only four and wasn't just like a huge laundry list of side quests that we've been getting prior to this. That makes things nice. But all right, uh, Taskmaster, I have come in search for a merit reward. Let's see. Enables the recovery of health through walking versus dropping more rare and valuable items. I think I'm going to go with healing through walking, uh, especially because we are approaching on the final dungeon soon. I feel like that'll be really useful. Or at least I assume we're approaching the final dungeon soon. Regardless, I think that is it for this episode. Thank you so very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, we'll, we will hopefully find the lost city of Nazca. See you then.